Hello everybody, Super Cat Curse here. Today I'll be showing you how to go live in Gorilla Tag. Let's go. Now either you got an Oculus this Christmas and you want to go live and make a YouTube channel, or you have had an Oculus and you just decided right now to make a YouTube channel and you decided to go live one day. Well, either way, today in this YouTube video, I will be showing you how to go live in Gorilla Tag. Here are the things that you will need. You will need a computer or a laptop that has Wi-Fi to stream out of, a Google account for your YouTube channel, and of course an Oculus. For these next few steps, I'm gonna have to go into green screen mode, so please give me a second. We I'm here, hello. First you're gonna get on your laptop or your computer and you're going to download OBS Studio. Now this is what we're gonna be using to stream out of and record out of. Now that you've installed OBS Studio, we need to go change some settings so you can stream. First, you want to go up to the little toolbar, then you want to click Auto Configuration Wizard, and then from there you want to click Optimize for um, Streaming First and then Recording Secondary. Then you just let it do the work and then eventually it will work and then you just set OK and then you apply those settings. Now that your OBS settings have been changed, you want to connect OBS Studio to YouTube so you can stream on YouTube. Okay, so on OBS Studio, you want to go up to the File thingy and then you want to go down until you see Settings and click on settings from there you want to select stream and then for the first option you want to put youtube rtmps then the option below that you want to put it to backup youtube ingus server or something like that then you want to go below that to hook up your youtube account and then you want to click hook up your youtube account like the recommended way or something like that it should bring you to a website and you just complete those steps and after you're completing those steps your youtube is connected to obs studio now that you are logged into youtube through obs studio you want to go to your YouTube studio, and then you want to go press the create button, it's over there somewhere. And then you want to press go live. This will not actually go live, it's just going to bring you like to a page like this. From this page, you can like edit the thumbnail, the description, the title, all that good fancy stuff. However, the thing that I do recommend editing is probably the thumbnail, the description, the title, and of course, the game girl tag. If you don't put the game girl tag underneath the gaming section, then you just won't show up on the Gorilla Tag Live and then not that many people will find your stream. However, if you do put Gorilla Tag in the gaming section, then you will show up on Gorilla Tag Live and a lot more people will click on your YouTube Live video and then they'll like watch it and they'll join your code. Now that you have filled out everything on the YouTube Live and all that fancy stuff, there are two ways to go live. You can either do it on Steam or you can do it on Standalone Quest. Now, I do mine on Steam, so we're gonna do that in a second. And a lot of people like to do theirs on a standalone quest, so we're gonna do that one first. Skip to this time if you wanna just go straight to Steam and not see how to do the standalone quest. Alright, so if you're on standalone Oculus Quest 2 or whatever, Quest 3, Quest 1, it doesn't matter. You wanna go to this website. Now that you are on this website, you wanna log in with whatever you're playing with on your Oculus account. Now you can finally get on your Oculus, and once you get on your Oculus, you should see like that reddish pink record button. You wanna click that. And then you want to look above and you want to click the cast button. You click the cast button and then like click like computer, go to a website or whatever. You click that then you click cast. And eventually what you see on your Oculus will show up on the Oculus casting website. Now that your Oculus is hooked up to your computer to live stream, you want to of course make a scene in OBS Studio. So first you want to make a scene, name it Gorilla Tag. Then you want to add a display capture and just make it your full screen application or whatever. Whenever you make it the full screen application, everybody's going to see your screen. So whenever it's time to go live, make sure you just go to the Oculus Casting website because everybody watching the stream can see what exactly what you're doing. Now that you have everything hooked up, you want to go to start streaming, then manage broadcast, then select the existing broadcast, and then select your stream of course. And then you want to click select stream and start broadcasting now. Now you want to go back to this live stream page and you want to make unlisted to public so everybody can see your stream. After you do that, you want to make sure that the game is girl attack so this way you'll get more viewers. And now from here, since everybody can see your screen, quickly go back to the Oculus casting website, make it full screen, adjust the audio and all that. And now you are live to all your viewers. Join girl attack, join a code, tell your viewers what the code are. And now you are live on standalone Oculus. Yay! All right, well now it's time to stream through Steam. This is a lot easier than standing on Oculus. If you just skip to this time from the beginning of this video, um, hello. So to stream from Steam, you wanna first open up Gorilla Tag through your Oculus where it's like connected to your computer and all that as a game. You then wanna go to OBS Studio and make a scene and name it Gorilla Tag. You then wanna add a game capture and you wanna name that Gorilla Tag and then you wanna make it capture a specific window and make that specific window Gorilla Tag. 
Now you gotta go to YouTube Studio and make the public unlisted thing go to public, of course, so people can see your stream. And then double check that the gaming category is girl tag, so more people will see your stream and join your code. Now go to OBS Studio and click start streaming. Manage broadcast. Select existing broadcast. And then select your stream. And then click the big button down there that says start streaming. Now put your Oculus headset on and you are live in Gorilla Tag and tell your viewers what the code is so that they can join you and play mini games or whatever you want to do. Alright, well, green screen to me is out. Let's go back to Stump. Whee! Alright, well, let's sit my name's Super Cat Crazy. We're trying to hit 2k before the end of the year. Sorry that we didn't do it last year, but at least we got the 1k. And yeah, that's it. My name's Super Cat Craze. Thank you for watching, and hope you have a good day. And hopefully, you can go live on Gorilla Tag. There's gonna be some better tutorials if you wanna watch better tutorials. I at least like give you some few tips. Well, that's it. Bye, guys. Super Cat Craze. Turkey leg, 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 turkey leg.